good morning. What is happening, y'all? Welcome to the second Candid Mets. That's right. We got our first win of the season last night. And it's really odd how the first two games actually really mirror themselves. It's very odd. I mean, we were up 2 nothing on Monday's game until about the 7th, 8th inning. We were up 2-1 yesterday up until about the same time. In the 8th inning on Monday, the embarrassment of embarrassments happened for the Mets. In the 7th inning yesterday, the embarrassment of the embarrassments happened to the Phillies. I mean, it's so weird how errors and, and, and ill-timed throws and stuff brings runs in. I mean, but it happened to us on Monday, but then it happened to them last night. You know, you kind of got to love that kind of karma. <laughs> uh, we got to see Marcus Stroman go, what, he went a full seven. And he is the ground ball king. And I saw an article this morning, he even said, you know, he, he, he doesn't pride himself on, on strikeouts, but them ground balls, 15 of 18 outs were ground ball outs yesterday. That ain't bad at all. Uh, this bullpen of ours, Rojas, man, I got a question for you. I got a question. If um, if the guy almost blows the lead, because Trevor May almost blew the lead yesterday, he set up a whole lot of ugly for the other guy to ruinate, which he most definitely did on Monday. So, why in the world do you have Trevor May go back out there, and he almost went to bed again. I mean, I get it. I get it. I get it. You want to give a guy a chance. You want to give him a chance to rectify, you know, a tough situation. But something is up with Trevor May. His fastball is not crispy. You know what I mean? And it was funny just how many breaking balls and stuff he was going with yesterday. As opposed to, uh, well, pretty much any other pitch. <laughs> you know, he was doing a lot of sliders and a lot of breaking balls yesterday and a couple of changeups, but not much heaters. And he's known for that crispy heater. So, again, I find that to be just a bit interesting. Uh, Jettius, Jettius finished it all for us. You know what I mean? Listen, man. I got love for Familia because of back in, you know, the the, the the 15 season and all of that. You know what I mean? Granted, he did fall off for the last few years. We know that, too. But, you know, I'm always glad to see Familia pitch well and get strikes. You know what I mean? He, he's family. He's La Familia. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, man. I love this time of year. I love being a Met fan. I love my Mets. But the only thing that drives me a bit crazy is that there's literally games almost every day for the entire summer. <laughs> so as happy as I was to get to my first 100 can, uh, candid minute the other day, it looks like I'm going to get to 100 candid Mets real easy. <laughs> All right, uh, we got another game. We got the, the, the trifecta game today. Uh, and that's this afternoon at 4 o'clock, which is good and terrible. It's kind of terrible because I'm still at work. So I won't be able to see the whole thing in its entirety. Uh, but it's also good because the Knicks play tonight. They play the Celtics. And, you know, the other night when... The Mets and the Knicks played at the same time. It was quite difficult. 
You know what I mean? Flip it back and forth. Watching both lose, by the way. That was rough, too. Uh, as I wrap up real quick, I do want to give a big shout to the Rangers. That was a heck of a win last night. It, it, it doesn't help, you know, on your playoff push. But smacking around the Penguins every now and then is also very nice. So uh, let's go Mets. Let's go New York sports. Uh, I do have a show tonight, guys. Candid Quarter tonight. Prince Poe will be in the building. Uh, Mr. Lewis and I are going to discuss Paul Pierce. Uh, probably getting into that a little lot. And a couple other things going on. We're definitely going to talk the tournament. And we're going to have a great time, as we always do. Thank you all for taking the time to pay attention today to my little minute. And I will talk to you all tomorrow. Oh, FYI, these, met, uh, these, these, these candid mints, I'm probably not going to do the whole season as far as daily. What I probably will do is do series. Like I, I'm doing these three right now because the Met series, uh, the Met season just started. But uh, the, 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 the Marlin season, uh, the Marlin series is coming up after this one. I'm probably gonna wait till after the last game and then just do a report on that. And then we've got a four game stretch against the Phillies before we take two against the uh, Colorado Rockies in the next week. So be on the lookout for this. Wonderful uh, baseball content because Coach Five does this too, baby. I will talk to y'all later.